and a family in mourning finds itself under the microscope tonight after a little girl suddenly dies. That's because police in Leesburg say the infant's death is suspicious. Diane Cho reports from Leesburg with what police and the family are saying. Here in the Oaklawn neighborhood in Leesburg. Usually we have been known as a very safe neighborhood and, and lots of kids playing around. So it's very shocking. Neighbors had no idea police were investigating a baby's death. Just a, typically a quiet neighborhood. Nothing usually ever happens. The child's grandmother told us off camera the little girl had been sick in the days before family members rushed her to a local hospital. She says the baby stopped breathing on Thursday. She was later taken to Children's National Medical Center in D.C. Once at Children's Hospital, a staff member there noticed some suspicious injuries on the child and contacted CPS and they in turn contacted the county who contacted, count, contacted us. Leesburg police say they can't comment on the child's injuries, but did tell us the baby girl was declared brain dead on Sunday morning and taken off life support. She died several hours later. That's horrible. While investigators wait for answers from the medical examiner's office, questions remain as to what may have led to this little girl's death. It is super shocking. It's really sad to hear about it. We're told the medical examiner's office in D.C. is conducting the autopsy today, and once it's completed, authorities say they will then discuss the case with the Commonwealth's attorney's office to determine if charges will be filed in this case. Reporting from Leesburg, Diane Cho, News Channel 8.